we're in Stainton, uh, which is just outside Penrith. Uh, it's a reasonably large village. There's about 1,400 people. Uh, we have a small school, um, a small uh, country hotel, a farm shop, and of course the pub and the post office, which is combined. We moved into the village about nine years ago and the public house came on the market. So my son and my daughter wanted to go into the business. So we leased it for a while. Um, and then about two and a half years ago, we managed to buy it. So it's a family run concern. My son, my daughter and my wife and myself are all partners in the, in the business. Uh, where my son lives in a converted barn at the back of the pub and my daughter lives in the flat above. We live in a house just around the corner where about six years ago the post office in the village shut down and uh, my wife took it over and we ran it from our house for a while. Uh, and then eventually we, we moved it down to the pub. When the post office was in our house um, it was getting a bit much because, you know, people tramping through your house. So we decided that uh, we had a garage at the end of the pub and uh, I was looking into converting it into the post office and a little shop for the village. Uh, and I got in touch with the post office and then Pub is the Hub came along and gave me uh, a lot of advice on which way to go, how to set it up, um, and what procedure I should go through. And between them and the post office, we got it moved. And it was at a time when they were actually closing post offices down. And, but f fortunately for the village, which it's an asset for, um, they didn't close ours down. And we managed to move from the house and convert the garage into the post office as it is now. When Pub is the Hub got involved, um, they did it more professionally than obviously I could do it myself because they said, we, you know, we'll look at this, the village and the, the, the size of the village, how many pensioners were here uh, and so on and so forth. And they also looked at the site where we were moving to. Um, and all this helped in the weight that they put behind when, when uh, we went to the post office uh, with, with our scheme to move it. And it, and it very much helped with, with that move. Uh, I, don't think, I don't know whether I would have actually got it without their help. Because the post office is where it is, situated at the pub, and, it, and it's open at the same lunch times, you know, it's open from 8 till 4.30, the post office, and we open for lunches at 12 o'clock, um, it does bring people here, because they come to use the post office, they might call in, they might only have a coffee, but at least, they find us and that, that I think helps a great deal and um, with, with having the lottery now that, that's made a bigger difference because more people are using the shop so more people know where we are so hopefully that will bring in more, more custom. I've been very pleased with the response from customers actually um, especially uh, we've opened it up now that we do papers in the morning, uh, we, we, we do our own bread and uh, the response has been very good and because it's, it's not only it's a community thing um, whereas sometimes there's some elderly people in the village and perhaps we don't see them for a couple of days and then perhaps you can start to think well I wonder how she or he is and uh, that way you can tend to keep a little bit of an eye on on the village people on, uh, on the elderly people in the village which is which is uh, all in the community spirit of of running a post office and a pub really we're uh, involved with the village and and uh, raising money to build a new village hall um, and we hope to that way more and more people will get involved in village life and in the pub and using the post office um, to just promote it that way really. Anyone else in the same position as I was in when uh, we first started this, um, I would definitely tell them to get in touch with Pub is the Hub because without any doubt they are tremendously helpful and will give you all the advice you need and perhaps put steer you in the right direction for loans um, or 
or anything along that line, uh, without question, get in touch with Publisher Hub. <laughs>